Why? What are you doing? Can I play Zelda with you? Can you play Zelda with me? Yeah. Thanks. What are you doing? Did you just wake up? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I, I did have a nightmare tonight. No, you stayed in your bed all night. Yeah, but sometimes I have a nightmare. Yeah. Yeah, and that's why I come in your bed. Sometimes. Oh, well, it's okay. What, uh, did you, did you dream about anything? Um. Keep putting your shirt on. I did not. You did not? Yeah. The hat protected you? Yeah. Where's my hat? Get your shirt on. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay. I don't. Yeah, I need a controller. You need a controller. Let's play. Yeah. 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 Hold on. Do you want a? You need a new <coughs> controller. Um. <coughs> your kids staying in their own bed all night is like magic. I know. Isn't it like magic when you stay in your own bed? Where's my hat? Did you wear my hat all night? Can you go get it for me? Um, yeah. Yeah, go get it. Go get it. Run, go get it. <laughs> he steals my hat. Uh, I showed my... Has Gina showed her tattoos? I'll, I'll have her show them. I think it's been seven years since your wife and you got to have your own bed for the whole night. Dude, um, doesn't happen often but i'd say it's happened like three of the last four nights and i feel like we're turning a corner maybe um so i'm pretty pretty excited about it he looks very sleepy it's kind of early in our house we're an eight o'clock get up house i'd say yeah my kid will climb in my bed with that even saying anything. What? Your hat? My hat's not in your room? You couldn't find it? That's okay. Can we? Yeah, hold on. Let me get another controller. Yeah, and I need to hear it. And you need to hear it? Yeah, because I'm playing with you. <laughs> Sorry, Chad. I'm sorry. Um, yep. Maybe ate an overnight snack. Um, I want... I mean, I don't want an auto-save it. You know? Maybe he ate the hat. Did you eat the hat? That doesn't even make sense. No, I did not. No. Whoa, it's snowing. All right, what should we do here? Try to get over there. Ooh, look, that's ooh. Oh. Can we put this steering wheel? Oh, I think the nuggets look good. But, I mean, Lakers. Alright. 
Yeah, if I had to put my money on one team, it'd be the Lakers. Which is kind of sad. Now, one rule of this game is to defeat all the bad guys. Yeah, that's one rule of this game, defeat all the bad guys? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, and say Bowser and Bowser Jr. Wait, Bowser and Bowser Jr. aren't in this game, silly. Um, but the... But he came in this game and then he saw a Oh, did they? Yeah. Is that how it worked? Yeah, loud for the rules. See? If LA wins, will it change anyone's mind on if LeBron's the GOAT? Um, maybe a few, but I don't think it's significant. If he won six, maybe, but I don't, I think everyone should stop worrying so much about it. He's one or he's two. What? I think I saw that guy. Whoa. That's a bad guy. That is a bad guy. Who just threw that bad guy? I hit him with an arrow. Oh, this this control center thing is awesome. I have a. This doesn't even seem fair. Oh wait. Oh, my battery died. your last he is getting so big what's your mom doing right now you're pat you're going where are you going today and Reagan. what are you gonna do have fun with them yeah how, how are you gonna have fun with them are you gonna play 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 Rocket go. What am I doing over here? You wouldn't have thrown the rocket, it was a bold move. Well, I had to get back. The casual airstrike? I know. Um, I I think the Lakers are going to win. And it's, but then again, I think there's a strong chance Joker might just destroy AD. Well, this doesn't seem fair. Like, these floating little, like, things don't even seem... Like, this is like a very easy flying machine to make, you know? Yeah, I can water your front plate. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can hose them. <laughs> I can hose them. You want to go with me? Uh, I want to play with Dada. 
Uh, don't worry, you can play with me when you get back. I love you. Give me a kiss. Look, I want you to stay right over here. You want me to save it right here? Yeah. Okay, so I'll save it. I'll save it. So we'll be right here when you get back, okay? Okay. Okay? Right there. Deal? Deal. All right. Deal. Deal. Okay, I love you. Give me a kiss. Mwah. Ugh. Ugh. All right, chat. Well, I can't advance at all. All right, let's go. All right, so we build a flying machine. We're over here. Let's see what's gonna happen. We're gonna have to load to that spot later. Broadsword, Claymore. Oh, what's this? Shield. It's all rusty and shitty. What's going on here? Uh, it's time for a sliver. You don't need a sliver. Listen, you're getting literal. You're getting just as much stream as you did during subathon, except you don't. I'm not sleeping on stream. here a light come on how many zonai tools are there a sled Chat, this game's so good. <laughs> Can we make a seaplane? Um. A wing, wing, a cart. We do five big charges. <laughs> fan, light, wing, fan, sled. Okay. All right. Now, what is this for? distance you think I'd get on this ship. Alright, let's find out. Let's find out. Let's find out. Oh, lots. Lots. I go deep on this. Don't even need to build a flying machine. Can you get a story recap so you know what's going on in the game so far? Zelda, okay, so Link and Zelda went to go investigate some shenanigans that were happening. They went splunking uh, underneath the castle. 
there was a mummy, an unnamed mummy that looks like Ganondorf at the bottom of the castle uh, that was being held together by like an, an arm and that arm fell out. He came back to life, broke Link's sword. It's a piece of shit, apparently. Mocked it, mocked the sword, mocked Link. Um, and then Zelda fell down a hole, warped back in time. Don't really understand why. It's something to do with the tears she picked up. Yeah. And I'd say that... Did I miss anything, chat? Uh, so Zelda's back in time with Raru, a Zonai, who's the original king of Hyrule. And she's trying to get back home. Yeah. The lore is hot? Uh, I mean, I don't hate the lore. The lore don't bother me. Uh, there's this thing called multi-twitch. You can watch both. Alright, so how do I open this guy up? Oh, I guess just like this. Never mind. <laughs> I thought I was going to have to do something to open him, but apparently not. He's just going to seek the crystal connected to the beam and offer it at the shrine. Do so, and I will grant you the light. Crystal over there? Build a plane, build a helicopter. Um, I need like, do I have a battery at all? I, I do have a battery. Could have built just a balloon, I guess. Yeah, I need the cart on it so I can make it move because it won't move on the ground. Is that straight? Uh, you can get catch show Pokemon with the shit you build. No, you have to play a gotcha game to get it. Ooh, I think that's gonna be good. And wait, where's that? Hold on. Does this thing have a steering? I'm, I was gonna grab this. 
Let me grab this thing. I feel like I should put a battery on it. Um, I feel like I should put underneath jets. Let me change this. Is this going to work? Mm, okay, I'm, hold on. I got to do one more thing. Uh, let's try the battery. That'll help balance it, too. And, um... I feel like I need a wing underneath it, but I guess not. Do y'all think this is gonna fly? Oh, probably not. I need to get these even. Yeah, that's good enough. Um, chat. I've built an entire fucking plane. Well, that was easy, actually. Let's see if I can land this bad boy. What? Oh, the building? Yeah, it's super awesome. I just built a fucking plane. You're intimidated by the building? No, it's not. It's not that hard. Um, chat. We have a fucking plane. Yeah, the landing. The landing succeeded great. The problem is, I don't really. I don't really need the plane for anything right now. I need to get that crystal. But it seems like kind of a pain in the arse to get. Can I make landing gear? I have landing gear. It's got wheels on the bottom of it. Honestly, it's pretty fucking legit. Like, look at this thing. Okay, well, that wasn't a good example. That was not a good example. Okay, that... that, that was in particular not a great example.
Oh, whoa, that's that island that lady was talking about. Wait, why is it blinking? Well, that was awkward timing. It's etched in Hyrulean text. Yeah, now I'm stranded. I know, I was about to say, now I'm fucking stranded. I didn't know, I didn't know that you could... Your flying machine could disappear. That's bullshit. Um, that was the first time I've had constructed stuff break. That must have been because it was too good. Yeah, it's such an old age and I really in text. You cannot read it. Um. Great. Awesome. I flew over here. Uh. Yeah. All right. Well, hold on. Wait, what? What if I put them up here? It's like, on one end, it's okay that it breaks because they give you so much shit. On the other end, you don't have to give us so much shit if it didn't break. So, I mean, chicken and the egg. Chicken and the egg here. Do I have another fan? The game looks so janky. I'm not your buddy guy. Um, I mean, it's not. I don't know what to tell you, but you should play it. Or don't. But don't go into streams and complain about it because the people that would, you know, because like the people that are having a really good time because that won't work out for you. I don't know what looks janky about my fucking bitchin' airplane I just made. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, where'd my plane go? Shit. Oh, wait. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Did we make it? Oh my god, did I just fucking top gun the shit out of that? Now my thing's gonna explode though. That was fucking sick. 
Where am I going now? Shit. Shit. Wait, I need to get off the sky. How do I get off the sky? There we go. Alright. We'll come back to all this. We need to head in this direction. <laughs> yeah, we need to head in this direction. Damn, I wish it didn't I wish it didn't explode and I could have turned it back around. I need to go back to wherever that was. Fuck. Is that a stable over there? I mean, I guess we're right here. We should get this. Yeah, I don't think my horse is going to be close enough. We're, we could get this uh, memory real quick. Yes, I saw the flamethrowing dick. I'm just sad I didn't, I mean that, I'm just gonna attribute that to someone who's been playing for two weeks. All right, yeah, I need my horse. Is my horse over there? Is there, is that a stable? I can't tell if that's a stable. No, I don't think that is a stable. I don't have a steering wheel. Oh, here it is. Look, chat, we found that quick. <laughs> well, that was easy. I'm glad we didn't leave. Yeah. Uh, Kansas Canada, we just don't care what you think. That's all. Oh shit. Queen Sonia. Oh wow. Queen Sonia. This is definitely Okay, okay, wow. Um all right, well this is out of order. Finally. We're Quentin Tarantinoing now. Finally it is mine. Oh my god, we just got Ganondorf here. He makes he makes my <laughs> My meat grow bigger too. Ganondorf's a mega hottie. An ultra mega hottie.
Oh, well, Lionel's are, I'm assuming, in the game, then. I haven't seen one yet. Sonia! You were too late, Rauru. You took for granted the godlike power you had in your hands. Do you now see the potential this is, you squandered? This is, I feel like, a very late... She is merely the first victim of your arrogance. You tried to control me, Rauru, and you will die knowing that you failed. And it died! Prince Sonya needs you! This one is so much bigger than all the other cutscenes we've had so far. Yeah, we missed, chat, we missed a little bit of, lore. I'd say we missed just a tad bit of lore. Oh wow, that's not even. How did we miss one? Where's one? <laughs> Yeah, how do we miss one? Uh, thanks that kid. Um uh, Okay, so something happens between Zelda realizing she's in the wrong era and then Ganondorf coming in. Link Link's got to be like, "Who the fuck is that guy?" Um, all right. I feel like that shrine's not too far, but it could just be like death perception and bright colors. Yeah. Um. Hey, listen, listen, guys. You could. <laughs> I don't care about Smash. I don't play Smash. Uh, I feel like that's actually a little bit higher than I need to go. How about hide and seek and hide? You never find anyone. You can just hang out. You can see someone coming from a mile away. You think I missed the first memory when I jumped off the right side at the beginning? That's entirely possible. Is that an ice wall up there? Yeah. Give me your arm. Whoa. You made me a 
biscuit and gravy pizza? What's up? Oh. Oh, never mind. Love you. Have fun. All right. And I'll fuse you with the horn. Uh, biscuit and gravy pizza. Uh, Chris G, I don't know if this is the place for your relationship advice, I guess. Some people just like to draw, I would say. Uh, cans of cans and, and Chris G, are you guys the same account? Just like talking back and forth to each other? Wait. I thought there was one for icy walls. Is there not one for icy walls? I thought this one was for icy walls. I'm slipping on wet surfaces. For sudden rainfalls. Is my wife OP housewife? She is not a housewife. She is an independent woman who don't need no man. Who would sacrifice her career in order to further mine. She don't need me at all. She was getting it before me. She'd get it after me. Why is this good? Mm. Mallet smasher? Go like this. I'm just gonna do this. <laughs> Name a single pizza that isn't appropriate for breakfast. I feel like all pizza is good for breakfast. I, I would I would actually definitely agree with that assessment. Uh, I actually think pineapple pizza is super dank for breakfast. What are you talking about? Do you really hate pineapple on pizza, do you? Could you not just pick it off?
Yeah, I was gonna say I like pineapple. I like grilled fruit though. In general. Yeah, I think I need to go over top and like this. Uh, to be honest with you, my only complaint about the shrine so far is like, the answers are a little too obvious sometimes. <laughs> I haven't like sat at one. I want to get stumped, you know? Hmm. Okay, that worked. Were shrines easier in Breath of the Wild? Uh, wouldn't I wouldn't say one's easier or harder. I, I mean, I haven't been stumped yet in this. Or as I could say in Breath of the Wild, I got stumped a few times. I don't know. I mean, the thing is, I don't know if that's a beginning puzzle or if that was a middle puzzle. Yeah. Uh, all right. Let's. Might be useful to go to the stable or at least get Gluey back. Uh, actually, it's probably just going to the Skyview Tower is probably the best bet. Is that it up there? What we got over there? Nothing big. How many hours in have I streamed all my hours? Uh, this would be hour, I think, 14. And yes. I named my horse Gluey. Well, we named our first one Bluey and then we sold him. You're an avid non-reader. You're reading right now. Every time you chat, you're reading. That's such a weird thing to brag about. You love reading. You're reading right now. You like reading and writing. I saw you can transfer your Breath of the Wild horses. That's still reading. Uh, oh yeah, something I, I hate when people say they don't like to read, because everybody likes to read, you just don't, like, especially books. Everybody loves to read books, you just haven't found the right book yet. And, that, and, and you know why? Because it's hard. It's hard to find a book. It's not like watching a TV show where you can watch a show and be like an hour in and you realize you're on your phone. No, nah, man, you can't do that with a book. Like a book, you have to like give a legitimate like 
five, six, seven hours to. The only real way to get recommended books is you find someone else that has similar book tastes, and then you all share recommendations. It's the biggest problem with them. Yeah. Um, cans of cans, are you, are you a, like a hostile person? You just fight everyone all the time? Is that your MO? Do I have any books I recommend? The last book that I re that I read that I really, really liked was Wind Up Bird Chronicle. But I should warn you that it's weird if you read it. It's really weird. Time off was amazing. Yeah, it's hard to know what your book tastes are at first, but like, when, if you get a book, like, I remember, the one for me was The Godfather. That was the book for me. And it was because I liked the movie, and then I had a teacher that was like, you know, it's a book too, right? And we had to read, like, we were forced to read for, um, because I lived in Kentucky and our, and our literacy rate was so low that they made everyone in school, grades one through 12, read for 45 minutes a day. You just had to read, independent read a book. That was it. It was great, actually. And it fucking, I lo I'm so glad they did that because it set up a love of reading for me because I found books that I liked and I was like, holy shit. I mean, like I would read, I read the Godfather. Like, I mean, I would just, I would read it eight hours, nine hours a day. Like I couldn't stop. It was like this fucking video game. Isn't this sketchy? Like, doesn't it feel like there's something here? Yeah. Uh, that was in the time when Harry Potter first came out. So a lot of people were reading that, and then the Lord of the Rings movies came out. Um, so a lot of people read that, too. So, it had, like, it created, like, a fucking, like, love of books for, like, my entire class. Because they, we all found something, we, you know what I mean? I, me and my buddies would talk about what book we're reading in high school because of that so shout out shout out to bad kentucky public high schools not teaching their kids to read so later on in life i got to read more Wind Up Bird Chronicle. Uh, it's a weird, weird, weird book, though. Like, I, I should pre-warn you. It's so... I don't think I'm going to be able to make this chat. It's a very, 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 very weird book. I might have to eat some food. Uh, yes, I want to check out other stuff he's written. He seems like my type of author. No, you bitch.
Should we just watch this fight? You think he's gonna give me credit for helping? <laughs> I will say that was very impressive move by me. You're just gonna walk away? I just just helped you. Uh, though I may not look at my monster hunter in a smaller town, I spend most of my days traveling the lands of Hyrule in pursuit of mere to prey. I'm at the quest of a fellow named Kotlin, presently hunting bubble frogs. Okay. Which cave? Probably every cave. Um. Uh, what's Percy Jackson? I never read that. Yeah, my uh, I got my son a Star Wars like chapter book, and he'll dabble in it, but he doesn't want to read it every night. Um. I think it's too high. It's very. The ascend is a little. I forget about it. You think anyone that doesn't enjoy reading shouldn't broadcast it as a virtue? No. Uh, I mean, I think the only people who do that, though, are children. You know, like, no adults doing that. You know, it's like edgy teens. I think you can see who they are. It doesn't, it's not least useful, it's just like the one I forget about the most. You hate reading? You write, you're reading chat. You love reading. Mm, I don't want to do this again. Damn it. Oh, I guess I could bring him up this time. Is this Skyward Sword? Yes. Damn it. Yeah, I would agree with that. I mean, what's sto the thing that stops people from learning something new that they want to learn is like the commitment. And being bad at things sucks. Rotate 180. Where were you shitheads yesterday?
All right. Yep, let's go. Let's go. It's gooey. It is gooey goodness. Thank you. You know I can make a good bridge. Feels like Fortnite all of a sudden. I mean, this game's got a lot of... A lot of... Uh, I wouldn't mind a creative mode in this. That's not... I have to climb up that? Why can't I undo him? Why can't I grab him now? Yeah, why can't I grab him? Got to use some good old gumption. Where's your buddy at? Wait, where's your buddy, though? I don't see your buddy. That's, that's what we call a feature. Um, I mean, I think it was just the angle, Crossy. I think it's like if you don't respect the rules of the game. It's not that, it wasn't that big a deal. It was fun. <laughs> yeah, hitboxes be weird. The only game I know with like amazing hitboxes is, I'd say Elden Ring has amazing hitboxes, but like Elden Ring isn't doing, like that's just fighting, you know? They're not doing the rest. Should I go back up to that? to this, right? Yeah, this is where we started the day. Plumbing through the snow like that would hurt. Uh, it wouldn't feel good. Neither would diving into water from the the depth sea dives in from, but here we are. Yeah, I don't think I don't think the the skydiving link does, but I mean here's the thing. Link is, you know, a, a bit of a badass. He can handle it. Hup. 
This is a game clearly based in realism. Yeah, exactly. Is that laser still up? came back to do this. Bastards. What does... Is the... Is the crystal, like, underneath it, maybe? Like, is it trying to go inside? I want to go underneath. Or is am I going through it? Because I did, I went on the other side. You're always trying to go inside? Stop here. Are you not gonna go lower? Can you not go lower? Can you only go higher? Um, I don't, I think the, wait, no, I don't see any landing thing. There's no landing thing here. I go get that? I mean, the blood moon's about to happen. I don't know what that means, if that's gonna reset that. When the glow of the blood stained moon shines upon the land, the aimless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. The world is threatened once again. The world is threatened once again. Mm, 
How often does that happen? Um, I don't really know. I think it's like after so much shit gets loaded in or... Well, yeah, I don't really get where I'm supposed to go. That, where did that thing drop? Did I think Vanessa is observing Zelda ideas and they make Skyrim too? Um, I mean, I don't think that, I mean, I think all, what do I want to say? Video game developers definitely play other video games. That I have no doubt about. Oh, there it is. I was blind. Old map, a very old map that shows a marked spot. What could that be? In the depths? What? what? I didn't even know I had a depths map. That's like, okay. Well, we gotta go to there, yeah. We gotta go to there. Yeah, I feel like, I feel like that's our, like what we have to do right away. We, I have to go talk to the Rito people though. That's like the only thing I know I have to do. Oh, wow, isn't that cute as fuck? I see how this is working. That's super cute. Did we already get that one? Yeah, I already got that one. Oh, I see. I see where I need to go. Oh, chat, you were like, chat was like, oh, you missed the spot. And I was like, oh. And now I need to bring this crystal back? Big ass fucking crystal. I wish I had my other flying machine. Yeah, I don't know how I missed that. Uh, they must read a lot. They do, they read chat all day. Sometimes I wish they didn't give us such, like, obvious builds, you know? Yeah.
This probably isn't obvious for 10 year olds, which is who the game is designed for. Uh, I don't know, I don't even think the original Zelda was designed for 10 year olds. I'd say Modern Warfare is more designed for 10 year olds than this. Uh, I have the just do chat. I have chat spoiling for when chat makes suggestions. I do have other pieces I could make something else. Well, I made that glider flyer, which I thought was actually really cool. Now that I know how to make those, like, that's actually kind of, that's a game changer. But they don't go that far. I need to get some capsules with the steering wheel is what I need. Oh, whoops. Do, 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 do. Let's put more batteries on them. Well, no, it ran out of battery. The batteries outlasted it. I don't know if it was because it was when I pulled out. I think the ones you pull out, like, break quicker. There we go. Uh, I haven't figured out a boomy zoomy like alternative yet, but I mean I figured out a straight up plane. So yeah. Like, God, it just it didn't break any rules, just was annoying the shit out of me. I try to be nice, chat. I know everyone just wants a place to be, and I try to be nice so hard. I did, I found the rock. Does Link do his taxes? Yes. Ooh, Raru's blessing. This better be something hot. Topaz. Vacation was amazing. Yeah, I had so much fun. Yeah, I found a crystal and he gave me a shittier rock in exchange. Uh, did this game bring back classic type dungeons? Um, I, I haven't made it anywhere, but I've gone underground a bunch and I've fought bosses, if that's what you're asking. But as far as like dungeon one, get an item, go to dungeon two, get an item, go to dungeon three, I don't think you're... I, I, I would probably guess that 3D Zelda isn't going to have much of that anymore. I think 2D Zelda still is, is likely to go that way, though. I've done so much, yet so little. It has an old map. Mm, yeah, I mean, I felt like that, and then I got in here, and I don't feel like I remember. <laughs> I don't know any of this map. <laughs> like, it's shaped the same way, and hat nose in the same spot, but, like, yeah, it's pretty drastically different, honestly. Where's the charges? I need these. I don't want 
want a sled, yeah, I want a cart. My steering wheel go. I don't know if I'm going to make this. Um, no, I don't need to go to the top guy to upgrade my battery. There, I can go, so go... Where was the other guy? There was another place I can go to upgrade my battery. It was like in, right in front of some village. That's great, but also disappointing. Brewers Town, yeah. Um, I need. I feel like I need the cart to like push these off. I want to go pretty much that way. want to handle this chat <laughs> yeah I'm going to the map location uh, then let's just bust out a fan. I pressed the wrong button. actually very convenient. Man, you can cruise on these fuckers. You slap a fan on this bitch and you're just moving. Link really needs a MacGyver mullet. Yeah, I feel like he had a mullet to begin. I mean, all this stuff I'm just passing over is annoying me, but at the same time. There's big lights.
How many arrows do you need? Oh. Really? That's what that was that's what was in there? <laughs> After that? <laughs> that was not what I was expecting at all, chat. I was expecting something cool. I feel like we're gonna get a good chunk of the map today. Yeah. Uh, no. I wish there was like an option that to like uh, use last arrow or something. You know what I mean? And there might be, but I just haven't found it. Or that might be coming later. Yeah. Was that a half pipe back there? Didn't see it. Um, Chad, I, can I be 100% honest with you? I just have to poop. I just ate breakfast and I have to poop. I will be right back. Yeah, I gotta poop. Let's all, let's all go poop. Can we all go poop real quick? Yeah, let's all, let's all, let's all go poop real, real fast. Yes.
Oh, I think it's so epic. Oh my god. It's cinema. That was cinema, chat. That was called cinema. I don't, it's not Joy-Con Drift actually that I use to do that. I use a coaster and I set it up against my controller. Cinema. All right, we're never skipping this movie scene. Sean, I want to say thank you for the sub. Hammer, a J Pet, a Snorri Webel, Rango Spet. Thank y'all so much. Upper ninety. I really appreciate the love. You're not done pooping yet. I felt like I was a pretty long poop. Running. Um, where are we going here? You think this snow's gonna clear up after I do whatever the Rito need me to do? Surface. Is that a fucking hurricane? guy over there. <laughs> Can I fly a fan-powered bird flamethrower? Yeah, dude, I totally could, actually. That I could totally do. TaylorMade, thank you so much for one month. Alright, we'll get this chill shroom. We'll go up here to the shrine, then we'll come down there. We'll beat that boss. Right? then I don't know. Wait, is this a shrine I've already done? Um. Wasn't this a snowy area in the first game? Yes. But the like it wasn't snowy where the birds live. Have I gotten more hearts? No, I'm hoping when I get to Rito Village I can hit a prayer stone. That's actually a big problem with the no fast travel is you don't hit a lot of prayer stones. Uh, more than defense. What up, dude? <laughs> Um. No. 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 
Oh, it just wants me to pick up this fucking shield. Yeah, it's already fused. I see that now. Honestly, I feel like I should just have a flamethrower on my fucking shield at all times, you know? Yeah. I feel like there's no... Oh. Look at you. Oh shit, he just whipped me. Stone slab shield? I mean, that's just a straight up... Yo, let's go. Okay, that's actually kind of fucking sick. Yeah. I didn't even think about putting stone slabs on there. I'm just, uh, not playing defense at all. We've, we've completely abandoned all defense, chat. Damn it, how did I get that to work that time? Um. <laughs> brute force is fun. Everyone loves brute force. Use the rocket to my shield? I mean, I guess I could. I haven't, I've never fused a rocket to my shield. Did not know that's how that worked. Did not know that's how that worked. All right. Well, glad they showed me that one. Cause that's fucking sick. That seems fucking awesome. That's way too convenient. What else can we fuse to our shield? Fuse the rocket to the sh sword. All right. Well, next good weapon we get, we'll fuse the rocket to it. Yeah, consumable revolves. Do 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 do. do. Rocket, 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 rocket. Let's go. I love the gotcha game. I actually don't hate the gotcha game at all. I mean, I, I get why they made travel so accessible in this game, though. You know, 
This game needs pretty accessible travel. It needs Plinko. Let me let me keep Plinko. Plinko's my thing. Nobody else is allowed to use Plinko, clearly. Oh. Yo. Okay. Okay. We need we got two of these maps. No, I, I totally agree. Plinko's pretty much just always fun. I didn't think that would work, chat. How many maps do I think there are? I don't know. I mean, I don't know what the maps do. So, I mean, I could not tell you. It kind of depends on, like, if they lead us to something really good. The fact that it wants us a hot air balloon. It gave us the things for hot air balloon right here. Make me feel weird. I feel like that storm, we're going to get rid of that storm at some point. Yeah, I mean, I'd say the only real ability, like, two, these two abilities, these three abilities have no, like, no combat use. This is the only one that has combat use. You know? And so you're, I feel like you are juggling maybe a little bit less in a good way. I say that as I'm about to use this ability in this combat. that broke. I'm just beating him with a horrible, horrible stick right now. Uh, my god. One day I'll learn. No. a bit more damage on this guy than on the last one. Uh, these are as hard as Lionel's. Uh, I don't know. I think I've got their combat down now, but that's because I got my ass kicked by one. Oh, two old maps right back to back? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> this doesn't look funny at all. Yeah, that one was just a one. The three, the three kicked my ass. doing this? I like how it gives you build examples. Did you guys see that dragon over there, by the way? Yeah. <laughs> it is kind of like playing games as kids again. Didn't it though? Okay, should we go to the shrine first? Probably. The Rito Village is over there. Let's just hit up the shrine. Yeah. Is there no fast travel rule I'm self-imposing? Yes. No, there's not an in-game option for it. Uh, it tried to make me... It tried to make me do something right away. It tried to make me fast travel right away, but... Didn't need to. Is this the new game? Yes. Plus. Hardcore mode e equal death equals uh, reset game. Yeah, that'd be a fucking pain. I would have to make a save after the tutorial. Is this another subathon or just an obsession? Just an obsession. Not another. Th not another subathon. Although you're you're more than willing, I'm more than willing to take your gift subs. And you pretend like I'm going to stream longer than I would. Jedi Survivor adding fast travel. <laughs> Being playing the whole game without the paraglider would be an incredible experience. I mean, I guess you, theory, could, couldn't you? Aid from above. Okay. Yeah, I mean, with enough zone parts, you could totally do it. I don't think it'd be a problem. Wait. Was 
There better be an Ocean's 12 room. It look, they showed her Mission Impossible room in the previews. Uh oh. I went the wrong way, it seems. Um. <laughs> I was like, I was like, how do I do this for a second? And then I figured it out. Yeah, then I figured it out. Uh, the problem is I need to go backwards to get my... To get my, uh, chest. I don't think I'm getting the chest now. Did the floor fall out, too? Ah, oh, well. No chest. Such is life. I took a left instead of a right. Who would have ever done that? Why would anyone ever do that? Could I just exit the temple and come back in? Yeah, but I don't really care about the... It's just like... It's gonna be like a ruby or something shitty. Did my wife take our dog? I feel like my wife took our dog, too. She took our kid and our dog. Is she leaving me for the weekend chat? Is this Sunday Mother's Day? It is? Hope be got or something. <laughs> no, my wife... <laughs> That makes sense. That makes sense. She would. She's going to hang out with her best friend, who's also a mom, and they're going to do their mom weekend. The grace. You know what I think's interesting, actually, about this game compared to Breath of the Wild? Am I gonna have enough? Um... That they don't have, like, the shrine counter and things on this one. On the loading screen. find that a bit interesting. I feel like this water would be cold. How many hours in am I? Uh, 15-ish? I'd say. Well, this place has definitely changed. It's fucking cold here now. One day I'm going to hit L first. Shot. Instead of up. Wait, what? They do? It's just at the... It's just on the right now instead of on the top? During the loading screen, it has your shrines and your Koroks? Have I been missing that? Am I stupid? Uh, you went to bed last night and you said you were on your way to Rito Village. I made it 12 hours later. We got highly distracted. I wouldn't even have came here, but everyone was like, no, nah, you got, you have to. It's, you're not even done with the tutorial yet. Great. 
great. Um, let's see here. There's so many buttons. Yeah, I feel like we always got to keep a flamethrower with us. Oh my god, the amount of aimless wandering you can do in this is insane. I have to get some more health, though, and some more stamina. Alright. Let's do it. After I finish the game, you want to see my completion percentage? Yours is 49.97%. Oh, I see it. It's over there. It does have your shrines. I'm a bitch. I'm an idiot. Uh, my completion percentage, I don't know, I think it's going to be pretty high. Look at this, like, top-down Zelda we're playing here. Yeah, this is fun. Uh, I don't think... I mean, I'm gonna wait a while to beat the game, though, so... Yeah, I'm going to be waiting like a good long while to, to actually beat the game. Like, we're going to try and get as much as we can before we... Oh. Uh, isn't that where I need to go? fun I don't I won't get all the Koroks though no uh, are we uploading VODs only the first hours up so far um, I am sure that we skill now is working on it as we speak There's over a thousand Koroks. I can tell you right now, I'm not going to get every fucking Korok. Uh, Juan Tulio uh, took a quick break for, to resub. Thanks. How am I liking it better than Breath of the Wild, Luther Kings? Yes. I think it's... Uh, honestly, it makes Breath of the Wild kind of look like a, a very like small game. I think that's like the only way I can describe it. Like, Breath of the Wild doesn't... like doesn't feel I don't feel like I feel very restricted now just thinking about playing it again what do they give out another golden poo for it yeah I mean I didn't get the first one so I think I'm all right oh please let me please let me oh thank god <laughs> oh thank god oh thank god
Oh man, there's just a family of Rito watching me get hearted on. I kind of wish they'd bring back heart pieces. Um, like, hear me out. Instead of giving you light vessels for the shrines, they could just give you heart pieces or stamina pieces. RBG Kane, thank you so much, Dan. Thank you for 20 months. Hard container. Yeah. Listen, I know. You're not wrong. This way you get to choose, though? Yeah, but... You can't... They can't just put, like, a random one out in the world, either. I want random ones to be able to be found in the world on top of just, you know... It's called the Song of Stormwind Arc. We're all going to sing it together and save our village from the upheaval. Huh? Are you going to listen to our song, mister? Let's hear it, baby. Yeah. We love an audience, so we'll give it our best for you. Everyone ready? A one and a two and a... Once a god fell from heaven, stilling the Hebra winds. The heavens grew lifeless just as the air below thinned. With the world in upheaval, we pledged to help the Lord. A line of ships soaring, built as a passage skyward. Stretching on the rhyming. The God ascended to heaven, leaving behind an ark. Its wind brought us new life, thanks to its great divine spark oh. the song's about the arc that saved Rito Village a long time ago something bad happened then just like it's happening now Why? I, I feel like nobody talks about the calamity weirdly though I wish they'd at least reference it definitely as Papa told me it's always watching over us high in the sky oh. we sure use its help with this awful blizzard most of the adults aren't around anymore because of the weird weather wait what ah. why aren't the adults around it's up to us kids to take care of the village. Practice over for today. You're in charge of food. Molly, we need you to make arrows. Got jobs to do, so let's do them. Yeah, kid power. Um, Wait, what are you going to do? Are you just going to sit here and sing? I do like the song of Stormwind. Sing it again. Pay attention to the lyrics. Once a god fell from heaven, sitting in, stilling in the Hebrew winds, the heavens grew lifeless just as the air below thinned. The world in an upheaval, we pledged to help the Lord. A line of ships soaring, built as a passage skyward. The God ascended to heaven, leaving behind an ark. This wind brought us some life, thanks to the divine spark. Something with electricity and wind. Um, yeah, the hundred year calamity, but like, I guess people wouldn't be like, we just ended the calamity, and now the upheaval? Gosh! Like, wouldn't someone say that? Link, you just solved the calamity! I want a Rito down bed. Give it to me. Give me that, give me that good Rito down bed. Uh, it is set in the same world as Breath of the Wild, but there haven't been many references necessarily to, like, the events that happened in it. And a lot of the memories of Breath of the Wild are just gone. It feels like. Like, where are the divine beasts would be a wonderful question. I feel like that's a justifiable question for fans to have. Dude, that Rito down bed was hot. I loved it. My god, look at that Rito down bed. I feel like it's always worth sleeping in the beds, Chuck. What do you got? You got cane sugar, goat butter, dang. You got oil jar. Uh, hot, what, what's nut cake? Appreciate your patience. Goat butter, cane sugar. Favorite type of mutt to make nut cake. Hot buttered apple, goat butter. It's mm. that good stuff. 
Yeah, let me buy some. Hi. Yeah, let me buy some of that. That good stuff. Yeah, let's get some of that oil too. Yeah, I want to own some nut cake. Is there anywhere I can cook this? Yo, you got somewhere? Oh my goodness, you've got clothes. Oh, well, I have to buy these. I'm here to sell. I gotta sell some of my. I'm not even thinking about it. Sell those rubies. Sell the sapphire. I can get more. I'll go underground and get more. Don't worry. Don't worry about me. I need clothes. Yes. Six fifty? Jesus Christ. Six fifty. What kind of racket are you running? That's some earrings. Uh, I'm sad. I I'm on a different switch. I don't have my. I didn't have my Breath of the Wild save on this switch. Um, and I need to. I don't have one of my horses. I'm actually really sad about that. I didn't realize that was happening. Yeah. What did I need? And then a nut, right? And then my favorite nut. No? Is it just in the thing in the nut? Is it not the milk? Oh. Whoops. Well, wasted that. <laughs> wasted that. Why no HUD? Uh, just for, it's prettier. Kind of enjoy having no HUD. And it pops up like when you need it. Uh, the only thing I think I maybe miss is the map, but I think it helps chat stay away from spoilers a little bit. Cause you might see something, but you'll be like, I have no fucking clue where that is. If chat is trying to do the thing where they watch, but not get spoiled. Uh oh, what's happening? That's not fair at all. You know I can handle it. Wait, are you the kid from Checking the first game? Huge cloud wouldn't be hard. I could even do it alone. Whoa. If we don't do anything, the village. Link. It is you. Link. Everybody loves him. Hi, Mox. Thank you for the love. I really appreciate it, Dan. Thank you. Link, they told me you were missing. It's good to see you're doing well. Tiba is the new Rito elder. Really? It's very nice to see you again. What's going on, Saki? I do remember Tullin. He's the only one I remember. I don't remember you two. I only remember Tullin. Well, maybe I would if he didn't treat me like a hatchling all the time. As long as you still think you can take on the world by yourself, you'll always be my little chick. Uh, I do remember uh, your child um, because your child was sitting right in front of one of the big DLC moments. You'll change your tune when I ace today's scouting trip. You can keep wasting your tongue your time treating this Song of Storm and Ark like it's real, but not me. Get it, Tullin. Listen, you. Anyway. Tullin wants me to uh, let him go find what's causing the blizzard, but he's having trouble hearing no. He mentioned a song. It's an old folk song here in Rito Village. Long ago when we faced a different sort of upheaval, the village was saved by, uh, thanks to a great flying ship. 
Or so, same, or so says a song that has passed. It's a song for children, mind you. Few adults still parrot it as if it was true. Still, every now and then, you get reports among the Rito of a flying ship. Let's go up there, baby. Let's make it happen. That's why I say we need to make careful preparations to find the truth, but Tullin thinks we can cling to that song out of cowardice. Huh. But these are Rito matters. <laughs> you know what? I came for Rito matters. <clears throat> what? This is terrible news. So they're not even Hyrule Castle is safe. Princess Zelda's disappearance is a strange phenomenon around the world. It related to some... Uh, uh, we Rito or daily... Would love to contribute to your search, but this is an abnormal blizzard and shows no sign of stopping. We have no food. All right, cool. Hmm. I wish there was something I could do. I... Huh. You should try asking Hearth. Your friend Hearth has many sources of information. So he might have a lead on Zelda. Hmm. They borrowed one of the airships from Zelda 3. Yeah, it's good technology. That Bowser airship technology is fine. Fine tech. Ooh. Quest? You have a quest? Those are mine, mister? I don't have enough wooden arrows. The Papa told me you can use ice fruit to freeze monsters solid. You can't go out and pick fruit right now with the blizzard and all. Uh, how much ice fruit do you need? Yeah, I already have ice fruit. Yeah, I already I already got it. I got tons of it. I got white choo-choo jelly? Okay. Yeah. Take it. Um, listen, I already know you can throw choo-choos and stuff on the tip of your arrows, okay? You're not... I know you're a kid, but you're not exactly blowing my mind here. All right, child? I would have been real bummed if I left and came back for that quest. Uh, thank you, Nell Ross, for 69 months. Uh, could everyone in chat please say... <coughs> nice. Wait, where do those bonfires go? Am I stupid? They're over there. Does new clothing allow climbing up ice walls? I haven't figured out any way to climb up ice walls. There's an elixir that let me climb up water walls, which was legit. Uh, but I haven't found one for ice walls yet. I like the... What did he put on the tip of this? Did he just put choo-choo jelly on the tip of this? Oh my god, this sign guy is fucking everywhere. Chat, sign guy is... is he drives me crazy. 
I, I don't know what I'm gonna get at the end of this, but it better be fucking amazing. I'm loving the game, Melanie. It is, I'm not even, I'm not being facetious. Like it is blowing my mind with how good it is. Fucking sign guy, what is your problem? You're obsessed, you're obsessed. Just kiss him already. Yeah, just kiss him already. Yep, I'm gonna support him. Let it go, that one was easy. What? His name's Addison. All right, that'll one. That'll want to work, Addison. Try letting go. There we go. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> Whoops. Wait, who's married? Addison's married or the president's married? That's all right. 20 rupees. <laughs> Give me that biting meaty rice balls. No, you haven't thanked me enough. Bomb flowers are pretty weak, but whatever. I feel like the Gare do practice free love. Hey there. Are you here because you spotted... I did spot the bonfire, uh, the bonfires. Uh, they eat up a lot of firewood, but it's worth it. You can spot them in the air. It can't be the spotlight set up around that fancy sky view tower. Ah. Yep, I already was up there. Ooh. My lands are pretty incredible to have built something so impressive. You're goddamn right, but it was actually the Sheikah. Don't talk about it. It's okay. Whoa. Oh. Mm. I've done every test I can think of, but I haven't learned anything. Not even for what they're made for. All I know is they're pretty heavy and pretty sharp. But it hurt if you got hit with one. Yeah, I'll take them. I'll take them. I'll also t eat your mushrooms. I'll take all your firewood. Your flint. And you know what? I'm also going to open these boxes you have here. And I'm going to steal your arrows. Thank you. These barrels you've been saving? I'm not even opening them. I'm just stealing your pine cones. I'm breaking them and stealing your pine cones. Thanks for the wood. Like, you're literally robbing these people. I wish more people got upset about it. Yes. Feathers are dealing with a more immediate problem. Everyone from the village is left to scavenge food because of the blizzard. And there's sky monsters everywhere. Oh. Sorry, bud. He just sorry bud me. <laughs> you've watched me play 20 minutes of this and you've seen three sign guys? I've hit, a, I think I've done more, uh, as many signs as I have shrines. Tullin's skill is cut above. He does preen about it more than should, but it's worth asking at least. He was up with Lazelle and Gazane. The Hebrew South Summit. The cave, uh, the cave is past the cliff out front. And up the mountain road, there should be a bonfire marking the spot. All right. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Learn anything? Mm. Anything <laughs> red? Okay. Oh. What about you? Oh, spicy peppers. Thank you so much for the food. Ah. There, I mean, I, one thing Link loves to do is rob people blind, you know? Like, that's Link's, like, honestly, his go-to move is just robbing people. 
Yeah. <laughs> He's a klepto. I had a, not a buddy in college, not a friend in college, he's a friend's friend, right? And he would drink and steal. He couldn't help it. And one day we had a party at our house and the next day he came back to our house. As I found out, he came back to our house and dropped off like three small things that he stole. He felt horrible about it, you know what I mean? He like would steal drunk but then sober would feel bad and bring it back. Like every time. I suggested to him, perhaps you should just not drink. Uh, but. Yeah. He came back with like our, our like he stole like a, Three foot bong from our house, chat. In college. What the fuck are you. How, like, why? Why? Unbelievable. Unbelievable that these huge things are raining down upon us. What is happening up there in the skies? Oh, I didn't expect to meet you here. What are you doing in the mountains? Did you see how cold it's gotten? Our feathers are the worst of it. I'm not sure how you can stand this blizzard. Don't worry, I'm cold too. Ah. See the Hebrew Summit Cave, your friends are there gathering provisions. All right. <sighs> yeah, you put a price tag on it and Link can't steal it. No price tag. I mean, that's kind of Link's thing though. If he sees a price tag, he's honest. He'll pay whatever the price is that you have marked. Now, if that price is nothing, he's just gonna assume that he can steal it. Uh, I like games that just give you the option to play, like, completely evil-like, you know? In general. Oh, man, why do you have so much ice cream? Did I show off my new cable management setup? Uh, a good chunk of it, but not yet. I'm gonna do a whole video, but here, look at that. And all my consoles are all hooked up and beautiful. Just looking gorgeous. Yes. I have eight, eight, nine, ten, I have 12 consoles currently hooked up that I could play. I could just switch with one to two buttons. Oh shit. What the fuck did you have right there? What's that Zelda screen in back? Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, that's just a monitor. Stop it. Stop hitting me. What is this thing he keeps hitting me with here? <laughs> He's murdering me. 
Uh, yeah, they run Wallpaper Engine. Uh, you're not sure you can name 12 consoles with some repeats? I have Dreamcast, Sega, Sega Saturn, uh, Dreamcast, Sega Genesis, Sega CD, Sega Saturn, uh, PlayStation 1, NES, uh, Super Nintendo, N64, GameCube, PlayStation 5, Switch, uh, Game Boy Player. Uh, I have a Famicom. I have another N64 I could hook up. Um, and then I have, like, space for any HD, like, HDMI console. I can just, like, shove them in there and take them in and out. Like, I got an extra room for an HDMI or a classic console. And all the classic ones are hooked up in RGB, which is like, oh, it's such a boner. So when you guys see it, it's very pretty. I don't have a Virtual Boy. Yeah. Getting a Virtual Boy you can stream is actually like a big pain in the ass. And also, nobody wants to watch it. So it's kind of like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't get a Virtual Boy no matter what, like to stream. But I do want a Virtual Boy. I don't have one. Um, it is a gap in my collection. Um, I didn't hook up my TurboGrafx-16 either because I don't have any TurboGrafx-16 games. I just have the console. So. There's 22 games, I think, for Virtual Boy. I don't think I'll be seeing anyone else in these mountains anytime soon. What with the blizzard and all. I'm here because it's a good place to find food for my people. Why are you here? Oh. Looking for Tullant. He's farther in this cave with Jassane. They're scavenging for food. No, I'm not going to show you the way. Ah. Ah. I, I'm, I'm, I won't show you the way. I'm absolutely not. Um. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That's funny. How be the new Zelda? Uh, it's quite possibly my favorite game ever. Oh, I dropped two. Shit, I didn't see it. it, it it's going to be... Once we're done with this, we're going to have to have a serious, like thought about where this game ranks is my favorite game of all time. You know what this game has done though? It's pushed Breath of the Wild deep down on my favorite games list. Like Breath of the Wild went from being a top 10 for me to like not even my top 50 anymore. I can't even imagine ever playing it again. But I did not been what I wanted to do. Yeah. It's just like, it's, Breath of the Wild seems like so incomplete now. <laughs> Let's hear a list of 49 games that are better. I didn't say, I didn't say 49 games that are better. I said 49 games that are my favorite. This is my favorite list. Like, I don't think, I don't, like, I don't think Spl Splunky 2 is my favorite game of all time. I don't think it's better than a lot of games. Does that make sense? How does it want me to get out of here? Let me just climb. Your my Mother's Day present is getting to play Tears of the Kingdom all day. It's a good one. Uh, Splunky 2 is incredible and amazing, and I love it. But I'm not going to pretend it's, like, uh, the greatest game of all time. Because I feel like the greatest game of all time, like, needs mass appeal. It's my favorite game of all time. But I feel like there's a lack of, like, you know, mass appeal options for it. <laughs> Mm. 
Wait, is this where I came from? Is this where I started? Yeah, this is where I started. Wanda Gamelon beats Breath of the Wild. I've never played Wanda Gamelon. I've never played the CDI ones. Oh my god, I think you're the first person to use that emote. Uh, you jazz. I think is just like arguably the greatest game of all time like so subjectively I think Splunky 2 is the greatest game of all time that's but that is my subjective like opinion it fits my appeal objectively I don't know Super Metroid, maybe. Yeah, that's, I mean, it's. T I think it's tougher. Doom, it runs on anything. Um, I think you might have to go like genre to genre for that. Like maybe. I think there's a lot of games that you could make the argument for. I think SMB3, SM, SMW, you could both make the argument for those games. I think Super Metroid. I think people, a lot of people can make the argument for Final Fantasy VII. I think Minecraft is another game you could make the argument for. I think League of Legends actually would have a legitimate argument, despite me, I've never played it, you know what I mean? I have no idea. But I mean, I don't think you can argue with its Success, you know what I mean? Longevity and overall addictiveness. Yeah, and then you have games like, you know, like something like Chrono Trigger, I was going to say. Um, I don't think you put Mario 64 in there. No, I think Mario 64 is utterly ridiculously amazing still to this day. Uh, but it's kind of like its lack of polish probably prevents it from being there. I think Super Metroid is up there. I think you could put... I know I'm missing a lot of games here. I think you could put Elden Ring up there, honestly, at this point. Uh, I think you'd probably t pick and choose whichever Zelda is your favorite and probably put one of them up there. Uh, Tetris? Oh, yeah, Tetris. Actually, how, how, are we, how are we ignoring Tetris? The answer probably is Tetris, actually. That's probably the absolute correct answer is Tetris. Yeah. That tell him. Mm. Uh, what are we doing with that boy? Just let him fly off in his own, leave all the food we collected behind. Oh, oh, yeah, I didn't even see you there. I was just talking to myself, which people seem to do here in Hyrule a lot. Oh, well then, it's such a fierce blizzard, yes. Mm. You're here to talk to Tellen, eh? You know, you just missed him. Uh, but we just saw a flock of monsters fly up outside the cave? Wait, what? Mm. Tell him clearly wasn't listening at all. He said, I'm going to follow them back to the nest and flew off alone before I could protest. Look at the bird's underwear. All right, we skill. Stop being a perv. You better include that in the YouTube video. Yeah, te Tetris. I, I actually would say... If I, if you put a gun to my head and said, what's the greatest video game of all time? I think it might be Tetris. I, 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 I would, I might argue with that. Yeah, I, I, I think that has the strongest argument to me of any game. Yeah. Uh, I think you'll find you're the lone cedar of Talented Peak. It's visible in the north after you visit the cave. Uh, Demi Wilson, what's going on? Well, I think, I hope speedrunners in this game, I, I hope this game's, like, the glitches are less for speedruns, like, I hope it's, like, a drastically different speedrun than 
Breath of the Wild was in general. I think it's going to be. Uh, but I just think that'll be fun for everybody. Yeah, Tetris is one of those beautiful games that's like infinitely easy to understand, yet incredibly forever technical. And you can watch two players that are utterly ridiculously great at it play it in two different ways. Oh my fucking god, dude. The speedruns are gonna have a problem? No, nah, I mean, games. Speedruns are just are what they are. Like they go, as, the game goes as fast as it can go. It doesn't matter if a speedruns four hours or five hours. If the world record is four and a half hours, and you had four hours and thirty-two, that's a good speedrun, you know. Try letting it go, my dude. No, uh, oil five darling. Yeah, I was gonna say Tetris is a game that appeals to like even the nonest of non gamers. So Yeah, I could I could see the argument with Tetris. That's the spicy mushroom ball. How many more of these signs do you have? I mean, you gotta have hundreds of them. Like, you're everywhere. This guy is fucking everywhere. This should be fine. That should cause no damage at all. No one's in any danger. <laughs> yeah, what are you what are you gonna get? Is there nine hundred sign guys? It's a lot of sign guys. I'm not mad at the sign guy. I like him now. I I was starting to hate him, but now I like him. sad way for you to die, honestly. Their body parts are worth so much, whereas like, I used to not just give a fuck about their body parts now, now I'd rather have their body parts than their weapons. You know? Uh, did I ever do the Rito thing? I'm at Rito Village right now, I'm like, in the middle of it. You had to take your daughter to school? You didn't let her skip school on Zelda Day? On Zelda release day? You had to go there for a meeting? Oh, is she in trouble? Your oldest tried to pull this. She sprained her ankle to get it to stay home. <laughs> you should. You should have let it slide. You know what? You should have just been like a homey parent. Been like, yeah, yeah. I let that one go. Go ahead. Go crazy. <laughs> but then, like, but then, like, you have the problem of. But I want to play it all day. Yeah, I was going to say, but then, yeah, you, then you can't play it. But um bump. It's 
not like they want kids to learn in school nowadays anyway. That's ridiculous. Kids learn, kids learn so much more today. Kids know more going into high school than we did graduating. About every 20 years, we add just an extra layer of fucking knowledge onto these kids. Yeah. No, man. They're, they, they are so much smarter than me. Haven't you ever heard the song, What a Wonderful World? I see babies cry. I watch them grow. They'll learn much more than I'll ever know. Uh, do I not have anything that'll knock this down right now? No, I don't have a sword. Well, maybe nothing will knock that down. Should have kept my guard. AI is going to make school wild. Um, I think AI is like a calculator for kids. That's how they're going to have to treat it. You know? Um... They're going to have to teach our youth how to use it effectively to get the correct results and write things they want. Show your work with stupid forever. Stupid monster. What, what, Link? Where did you come from? Oh, huh, you see? That rotten monster took my good bow. Oh, that, that bastard. He's a bow napper? I want that bow. That bow does look nice. I'll, I'll admit. Uh. Oh. Yeah, I agree. I think AI has to be embraced in our schools, in our... Uh. Tullin's power when When Tullin's aura is charging, create a stream of wind that blows straight forward. Okay. Um, I'll give you a hot take about AI's harmfulness. Oh. It's not artificial intelligence that is harmful, okay? It's the fact that artificial intelligence is only going to be used to exploit us more in a capitalistic society rather than creating a situation where we can pursue endeavors that bring us true happiness uh, and work less. Uh, people aren't thinking, oh, we can use AI to make the work week 30 hours or 20 hours or 25 hours. They're using it to think, oh, we can just eliminate all these jobs and never pay these people again. That's, that's the problem with it. Um, it's, not, it's not AI. AI is actually amazing, could be amazing. It's the fact that it's going to just be used to exploit us here in our final stages of late stage capitalism. <laughs> it is new, what's going on Gavin? This is brand new today. Mm, I didn't say that. I'm in America, I didn't say that, Squiddy. What I'm saying is, as we become more and more efficient and uh, productive in life, us humans are more productive than we ever have been. Instead of just constantly being more productive, maybe, maybe we could turn our pursuits to things that benefit the world, our health, our mental, our arts, and things like that. Does that make sense? You know what I mean? It, instead of just using it as a way to exploit and produce, 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 produce forever. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you big time, Link. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't McCarthyism me. Uh-oh, these motherfuckers are coming in. 
There's more of them. That's gonna have to be cut out of the YouTube video, by the way. Alright, let's fight. Let's fight. Make a whole YouTube about my political takes. <laughs> I wish I had, I, I kind of wish I had like a whole separate thing where I could just talk about shit, about life, but. I like playing video games too much and I don't want to get involved in that world. Uh -huh. Oi. Tullin, Link. Huh? <gasps> huh? huh? Oh, you're gonna be in trouble, Tallinn. I think that's your mom and dad. No, you're lucky. You're lucky that's not mom and dad. That was some impressive teamwork, you two. You saw that, Arth? Talk about embarrassing. I, I didn't listen when she tried to stop me. I thought I could handle it. But I just lost my favorite bow. Hmm. How does it feel that B can discuss politics, but I can't? I mean, B knows about Mexican-American trade relations. You were right. It's really important to work as a flock. I think I finally get what Dad has been trying to tell me all this time. Is that all there is to the story? It seems unlike you to let your bow be taken, Tullin. Oh, yeah, funny story about that. There was this whole thing with Princess Zelda. What? I spotted her getting attacked by a monster. It was such a surprise that I dropped my guard and stole my bow, but I guess she was fine because she zoomed up above that cloud. Uh -huh. oh. What drugs were you doing? Link came out here looking for Princess Zelda. We should go investigate the cloud. But I thought I wasn't uh -huh. allowed. I got a report before coming in. I think it's likely that the blizzard is coming from inside the cloud after all. No shit. Of course the kids, of course the blizzard's coming from the cloud. But he's just like, oh yeah, I saw Princess Zelda. He wasn't like, there's, he wasn't like, I saw Princess Zelda and also my bow's taken. That little shit was like, I need to get that bow back. I'm gonna only tell him about that. Captain Friendship, thank you so much. Gavin, I fucking love you. Gavin, how's the marriage life treating you? Is that a Rito Live cable crossing the stormy sky and making it all the way there? Uh. Talking about you, Tullin. Only you have the skill and training to create gusts at will. Uh. You know who said that to me? Your old dad, Tiba. Dad said that? Uh. Yep. Now make sure he knows what you accomplished here today. Now it's time to go with Link to find Princess Zelda and whatever's uh -huh. causing that blizzard. We got this. We can do this. Oh. I need to eat real quick. Strong wind. What do you? What, how am I supposed to get up there? You're gonna push me all the way up there? You know what? I got an idea. I got an idea. Because you're not really that much help. I gotta be, I gotta be honest. Here. Can you, can you like push me up? For you this time. Too bad there isn't a skill that lets me go up. 
Don't need that. me there you suck you suck bird you're horrible yeah the rocket shields legit I didn't know about rocket shield I wish the rockets lasted just a little bit longer yeah I miss Rivali's Gale my dude. Wait, I just have a stick? What the fuck? Dude, thank god I got some more stamina, though. The stamina increase by 50% was huge. Uh, is there lock on? Yes. Oh, uh, yeah, like the ch Yeah, I don't know. There's. I, I feel like there should be some more Breath of the Wild references. Yo, how did I not hit that one? Is that weird to say? I think there should be more. I, it just bothers me that no one's acknowledging the calamity. Like, I feel like so, there's got to be someone out there that's like, oh, like Tullin is like, oh, I was just a child when the calamity happened, and now I'm a grown-ass adult. I, yeah, I guess I haven't heard it yet. Oh. Why is it Tullin? I was too focused on the cloud. Yeah, you guys talk to yourselves a lot. Oh. I knew it. Something told me you were the best one for the mission. Everyone has admired your wind gusting te techniques since you first demonstrated it. Ah. The what do you mean? Tell it the calamity lasted a hundred years. Uh -huh. mm -mm. I haven't been on the plateau at all, actually. Ah. Yep, we can do this. How long after Breath of the Wild does it start? That I'm not 100% sure about. I don't know if four make it better, but it makes me feel better about what I'm about to do. You know? How old is Link in this? I don't know. I mean, that's, that's kind of my thing is like Zelda and Link did not age a lot. So it can't be that long. But then again, Zelda and Link both were over a hundred years old. Peru is over 100 years old. Impa is over 100 years old. Right? Like, all these people are already decently old, so...
Yeah, I see why that didn't work, actually. Yeah. I don't know why, but I get a kick out of every time we throw something, just throw something off. Uh, a physics-based game, don't care if rockets exhausts are blocked, but this one does. I mean, that made sense that it didn't work, you know? What am I searching for up here, guys? Oh my god, is that a ship? around here that you saw Princess Zelda, but now you don't know where she could have gone? Hmm. Ugh! What is that? It's a goddamn ship. It's a floating boat! Maybe Bowser is in this game. How much did you miss? Um, I don't know. Come. Did you watch yesterday? Come. Come. To me. Glad you clarified. <laughs> Whose voice was that? Really, really glad they clarified that. <gasps> You see that thing inside a cloud? Is it another boat? There's tons of little flying boats too. You know what it reminds me of? Hmm. A line of ships soaring, built as a passage skyward. The god ascended to heaven, leaving behind an ark. Yes. Oh. Huh. Maybe she went over to that <laughs> ship? P perhaps. We got trampolines now. Sweet, five arrows. I'm never mad at arrows in this game. Uh, Cass? Cass is dead, dude. Cass is long dead. Cass is definitely not in this game. Super dead. You just gotta accept it. Yeah, rip cast. Oh, I'm in the eye of the storm here. You just ate the plastic on the slice of cheese? Yo, I've done that before. I mean, I've taken a bite. I didn't eat the whole thing. Like, I, I would take the plastic out. I'm not a psychopath. Okay. 
That was easier than I thought it was going to be. I thought we were going to have to do something kind of crazy. thought there might be something on this for a second, like actually on the boat, and I had to check. Like there might be a... This is awesome, just jumping trampolines. There might be something on the boat. Why don't you check the boats for chess? I like how someone says the thing I was literally doing. Uh, Sky, you don't have to delete that one, that one's okay. Yeah. You don't have to delete that one, you can just mock it. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> we almost missed that. Yeah, I mean, I feel like that's the only spot that we can go for. Um, oh, that's cool. The trampolines redo your stamina. I didn't realize that. I feel like that was on the edge. I don't I don't know if that one should have counted, chat. Yeah, I was gonna say that hitbox is pretty generous. Chess has to be on one of these, right? It's gotta be on one of these boats. The fact that Link can just mob this so easily is so... Like, he's got incredible leg strength. Whew, that was kind of a pain in the ass. He would have broke his ankles? Probably. I wish you could do flips. Worth it. Worth it! I'm just impressed that, like, these boats can handle that, you know? These airboats. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, Link's, his grip strength is just top tier, you know? Link's, Link's ability to just hold on tight to things is incredible. Oh, I'm glad I don't have to go back down and get him. You have to assume the boats are serviced regularly. That makes sense. I think I'm gonna learn this gust thing he has. Oh, Jesus Christ, dude. Yeah, Link's got great core strength. Dude, Tullin is not playing around, yeah. Not, but worth it. I didn't even realize he shoots with his feet. You have the next Mario games on this level? Uh, I think the only thing that I really would want Mario Odyssey to do that Mario... Like Mario Odyssey 2 or whatever the next Mario game that Mario Odyssey didn't do is a like centralized hub world a la... You know, Mario 64 Galaxy kind of style. I, I really, I think they're really fun. I really like them. I think it's a fun way to get around levels. You know, the overworld map I, idea, like concept kind of just fits. Well set. For those games. So that's the only thing I'd, I'd really like to see Odyssey do. I mean, I really don't know what, where they're going to go with another Mario game. I feel like they got to keep the cap jump. It's so good, you know? Uh, love some eggs. Uh, no, we've got, we haven't gotten too many, like, new, like, gotcha bubbles. Just the cart, which we've seen before. Yeah, I just, I don't know where they go the next 3D. I mean, I honestly, I think they should make a 2D Mario. I, I feel like it's been long enough. Um, I don't think they're going to make another Mario Maker in the immediate future. Whether or not they should is a different different conversation but I don't I don't see them making another Mario Maker in the immediate future right now so portable pot hmm? 
I really need to get some more fire flowers. I love that one. Yeah. Super Mario World 2, that would be rad. Like, just making a true sequel to Mario World 2 or Mario 3. Um, I just hope they leave the new soup in the rear view mirror. This is already, oh, it's already a club. Never mind, it's already on the club. I'm an idiot, that's why it's not letting me. I hate when I can't see the, the actual weapon below it. Uh, no, I found a statue to pray to. Uh, I mean, we could fight this guy real quick. Uh, it's only a level one. I know, once you beat a level three. Oh my, stop it. Stop it. Uh, what's going on with this place? Let's go. <laughs> what do you got? Uh, Tallinn does work, man. Let's go. These old maps. Very interested in what the old maps do. They're all underground. The fact that I don't have any underground map makes me both excited and terrified. <laughs> One day I'm gonna hit L to pull up my menu, at the right menu. Oh wait, wait, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, okay, Wisco, thank you for 47 months. Piorgi, thank you so much. Uh, Dogs of Wall Street, I greatly appreciate the love. Kind of running out of fire and bomb fruit. Gotta be a little bit careful of that. Smooth. All for ten arrows. I kind of need the fruit more than that. I got arrows. I, I feel like they should not be putting arrows. Like, I don't get me wrong. I'm glad I'm getting arrows, but maybe not in chests, you know?
I love bullet time. Oh, did he just pick that shit up for me? My dude. That was an embarrassing way to lose a fairy. Yeah. This was pretty embarrassing. Uh, some chests look like more important than others. Really push the limit on that one. Yeah, it was a, a bit of a butt clencher. Gives you a lot of opportunity to cook if you want. Yeah, a lot of opportunity. Um, I wish this game was just multiplayer. <laughs> yeah, I wish you could just play a multiplayer Zelda where multiple people could go through an adventure, you know? I also wish you could like build things while you're falling. Like I wish I could use I think that was supposed to just troll me and I, like, randomly picked that. <laughs> this is a fun little adventure, man. Ow. That was my bad. I don't play much defense, chat. I don't know if you'll notice that. I'm not playing much defense here today. What the fuck? What the fuck just hit me? Who had the bombs? Yeah, who had the bombs right there? I was gonna say, where where do I where do I procure these bombs? Are there more? Because I don't really want to use my bomb arrows. Bombs? Bombs? Okay, I'm okay with that. I 
I yeah, I've never I hadn't seen those bums. The best defense is a strong offense. Yo, that's what I've been saying for years. All right. Do I got anything else I want to use? Oh, I see. Whoops. Mistakes were made, chat. Mistakes. Have been made. They are bombs, though. Yeah, they are definitely bombs. I love how simple it is to make pretty cool shit. Uh, Grego Sars, thank you for 69 months. <clears throat> Could everyone please say nice? Right in the center. Welcome pilot wing style. my first time flying this high. The air's pretty cold up here, huh? I'll be fine, but what about you, Link? Make sure you don't freeze, okay? Dude, I have on boots. I'm good. I have on boots. You've lost all sense of direction. Yeah, I think I'm just principally going up in a circle, like upwards. Uh, I got to pee real quick before I do this chat. We're going to take a second. I'm going to get you some cinematics here. Although it's not very cinematic at this moment. Not very cinematic at all. I'll be right back. I'm going to go pee. Yep. Where's the subathon counter? It's gone. Everything's gone. It's all over. Now it's just link counter.
sorry. Sorry. Oh my god. I almost just fell off the entire map. That would have been horrible. That would have been horrible. It's not drift, it's cinema. Uh, no, we're not on a subathon right now. We're on a Zeldathon. Wait, this is a freebie? We're getting a freebie right here? All right, let's go. What is the large one? Like, should I be putting those in the gotcha machines? Yeah. Yeah, I like the freebie shrines visuals. I gotta order a pizza at some point today, chat. So remind me around two o'clock to order a pizza. Large one gives you the same amount as five ones in the gotcha. What if you put five of them in there? What does that do? Pacific. We're really going up there. How high and low does this game go? I'm very curious about this. Because I feel like we're super vertical. Yeah. Uh, the small charge is five. I thought you needed five for the gotcha. The gotcha game is small charge. Oh, really? That's cool. I just pretty much just load up on every gotcha that I see. I mean, there's no shortage of small charges. This is a fucking sick section, by the way. <laughs> like, we're really doing this. I like how even in the background, like, even here, you can still see the calamity coming out of... Is that Death Mountain, or is that... Sorry, the gloom. I'm never gonna stop calling it the calamity. Is kind of mad that the switch can run this. Doesn't this game makes this game makes me annoyed at like every other video game. Like its vastness, its epicness, its openness, uh, its lack of loading, um, and also just like how fucking smooth it's running. It's really. Oh whoa! It's really. Um... Making me angry. Wait, do I want to go in the middle one now? I guess we're doing it. I'm looking to see if I want to go over here, but I don't think so. I don't see anything up there.
The Wind Temple. The legendary Stormwind Arc. Oh, the temple. They're calling this a temple. That's, um... Okay, here we are, chat. Here we are. For those who wanted dungeons... Traditional dungeon style. I mean, that's definitely, they, they're calling this a temple. I don't know what else we can do. This better satisfy the people's needs. I'm very hyped right now. This is what is waiting for us in that huge cloud. This is the Stormwind Arc from the kids' song. Huh? huh? <gasps> Zelda! Huh. Let's call out her name, maybe? <gasps> what the? <laughs> Let's cruise it, Link. The blizzard that's been pounding Rito Village is coming from there. Didn't I see? That was Zelda. It was clearly Zelda. You saw Zelda. Aren't dungeons underground? Uh, the water temple's underwater. Bitch. Get wrecked. Uh, I'll use this piece of shit right now. <laughs> kind of makes sense for a wind themed dungeon to be in the sky. Yeah, it'd be weird otherwise. Kind of agree with that. Oh uh, no. Okay, how are you? Alright. See what else is going on over here. Yeah, I'm wondering how big it is inside of this bitch. Interesting. We got tentacles. <laughs> how do I feel about the removal of infinite bombs? Um... Honestly, uh, pretty okay with it because I thought infinite bombs were a little. a little OP, maybe? You know? That's kind of a traditional Zelda thing to not have infinite bombs, so I'm alright with it. Yeah. Yeah. One day, chat, I'm going to remember to press the L button. Wind Temple B1. If I open the chest and get a compass, you're going to freak out. I feel like we'll probably get a map. I don't know about a compass. If I open a chest and get a hook shot, I'm going to freak out. That's interesting. 
Okay. There's a lot going on here. How many hours am I? Uh, I don't know a lot. 17? Yeah, 17-ish. Okay. Touching that probably was the first thing I should have done. Okay, that just sets up a fast travel marker. We bring these down. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Looks like it's shut tight, but the source of the blizzard has got to be right under the hatch. Is there some way we can get it open? <gasps> That sound, there it is again. What is happening to you, Tullin? Brave fledgling. There are still five locks securing the hatch on the deck. Use your power to release all five locks, and the hatch should open. Oh. Heed my words. All right. Huh. You heard it for sure? It was calling out to be loud and clear? Yeah, I mean, I think that was pretty obvious. Who, who was talking right there? That wasn't Rivali. Was that Ganon? I don't think that was Ganon. Does this count as a dungeon? Uh, it said temple, is what it said. They called it, they called it a temple. So we're going to put a handle on this. Open that one too. Yeah. Yes. It's the wind temple is where I'm at. Oh shit. You just got wrecked. some food because you just smacked me like a bitch dude I'm not even gonna front oh uh, well, this is the first one I've seen yeah hey wife you made it you're all good Have fun. I love you. Uh -huh. Hey, look at that. I was looking at it. Is that for one of the locks? It's kind of shaped. It is kind of shaped like a windmill. Kind of shaped like a windmill. Our homie can fix that. Hey, Link. This thing opened one of the locks. We got... Let's go. Let's go. 
Let's go, my dude. You genius bird, you. You freaking genius bird. Look like it hurt. Yeah, I think that one looked like it was bad. Yeah, you can fuse with the giant ice school. Large as a night. Shield broke? No, I've had that shield forever. Good, I need your eyeballs, bro. Um, let's drop one of these. Oh, I dropped two. I didn't mean to do that. Looking for a nickname. Thank you for the tier two sub. You are fine. He does seem like he kind of is Tails, honestly. The game trailer, you felt like it has spoilers? Uh, I don't think spoilers ruin things for people. <laughs> Whoops. Have I tried parrying? Yeah, I don't parry often. I don't have any shields. I need a shield. Uh, yeah, I use big two-handed weapons and do dumb shit like that. Um... Good. Yeah, I mean, you're right. I don't need a shield. If you don't play defense, you don't need a shield. What am I talking about? No, I'm not okay. I just got smacked in the face. I mean, I will say this does feel a bit more dungeon-like. And then say previous games. Uh, I want to go up there. So 
let's... Do we got a rocket? Right, let's just take the balloon and the flame. you to go a little faster. Is there an ability that takes you straight up? Yeah, like some sort of ability that just like goes through ceilings? Yeah, I mean, isn't there one of those? Do I forget about it in favor of balloons and rockets all the time? Fuck yeah, I do. No, no, that was a legit question. We even have an emote for it and I never use it. <laughs> I forget all the time. Ah, the Captain Reaper. Did you throw it up and then just reverse it? Yeah, the reverse is definitely one I'd probably use the least that I use more. Hmm. Leave it to me. Let's put a rocket on here and just see what happens. That worked. Probably, probably gonna just use the fan. It looked heavy though, you know? Yeah, that was sick. <laughs> I mean, there's definitely like a way to do it without one of those things. If you didn't have one, you know, there's gotta be a way to do it. But I mean, I love that that's the way we did it. God damn it. Faster Amazon? Oh, you're waiting on Amazon? Three more to go. We can do it. Yeah, the entire game just being sticking things together would be totally okay by me. Let's see, I think those are probably under the ship somewhere.
That was bad. Um. Shit. Shit. Yo, what's going on, Lord Rochester? That was embarrassing. Yeah, Tullin saved us. I just can't. No. Did that just hit me? Oh no, I was. I thought that icicle on the ground hit me for a second, and I was like, that's. That seems like some bullshit. Yeah. Yeah, like I stubbed my toe? That's exactly what I thought. Did that. Hmm. doing? Why didn't I just heal? Why didn't I just heal? Why didn't I just heal? Or jump? Or do anything? Did we got to order the amiibo? Did they sell out? can't find it anywhere. Oh, that sucks. Uh, I'm sure they'll make more. Yeah, I'm sure. You can drive 40 minutes to get one. I don't know if I would do that personally. Icicle, I think, might be able to.
Let's go. You've never bought an amiibo? Uh, you know what? They, for the game, the thing they do with the games, not that great. But they're really, really nice Nintendo display things for relatively cheap. Like, they're very attractive. They're, they're all well-made. They all have good detail on them. They've got a nice stand. Yeah. Um, I wouldn't say the actual, like, use of them is there. Or do, or no, I'm missing this one in the middle. Or that one back there. Hmm. Wind Temple 1F. Uh, what would y'all say? Is this more of a traditional dungeon? How are the traditional dungeoners doing right now? Yeah, I would do it. I would do that too. The a Ganon one would be hot. Definitely a lot more aesthetic details. Yeah, it's sharp. Like it's a very, it's very pretty. I don't know if it's gonna be particularly long. How did I not get a parry on that one? Getting hands on amiibos used to be harder. Yeah, I mean, there's not like any, like amiibos aren't gonna sell for like thousands of dollars one day, I don't think. Well, you know, I, I shouldn't say that. I didn't think Charizard cards would be, so ooh, a Zonite shield? What? What? <laughs> Okay. Uh, thank you, Tier 1 Engineer. Thank you, Becky Blaze, for 73 months. It's so long. Uh, Stingle. Yeah, they... It'll go out pretty quick. Wait, I fucked up. Amiibos don't seem to be intended to be worth thousands. No, but like when they first came out, like that's how people were treating it, you know? Like they were like collector's items because they were so hard to find at first. And then all of a sudden, you could find them all, all the time. 
Yeah, they're like Beanie Babies, except they're cool. <laughs> the problem with Beanie Babies is like nobody wanted to actually like display the Beanie Babies. I display my Amiibos still. Like I love my Amiibos. They're I think they're sharp. You know, like they're they look good in my room. Got this backwards. Backward sound going right now. Oh, where am I going? to get in there. We want to go out the back. We want to go in that. One in the all the way to the back, and then one underneath there. Do I take mine out as a package? Uh, yeah, I take mine out of the package. I, to be honest with you, I don't. I just enjoy my shit. I, I try not to worry about how much it's going to be worth later on. Because there's, A, no way for me to know that, and B, I don't, I want to enjoy it, you know what I mean? I just enjoy my, th I want to enjoy my things. This is tough. Yo, he's... I think what's impressive is his headshots every time for him, you know? Every time. Uh, maybe 16? You can see how pro mode no minimap makes this a lot harder. Um, I just think it's more attractive. Can you turn off the duck and button display? No, unfortunately not. I've turned off everything it'll let me turn off. Mm -hmm. 
got the one down there. Yeah, it definitely doesn't make it easier, and you're checking your map every once in a while now, but... I wish you could mid-backflip. Do a... Alright, I'm just going to press this and see if I, anything happens here. Like, is one of these going to open? No, okay. Alright, I just wanted to make sure. Yeah, well, you know, I wish you could pick, like, what HUD elements you wanted. Because I wouldn't mind the mini-map, like, like if I could press a button and then press, get the mini-map up, that'd be nice. Yeah, yeah, I'm kind of anti-HUD, too. What happens if you hit that laser? Alright, it's the one right in the middle. It's like down there somewhere. Yeah, is this a dungeon? It's a temple. Yeah, I wish I could toggle the mini map just on and off. Just, like just the mini map. I like that the hearts toggle on and off when I get hit. I think that's an appropriate time to toggle on and off. You know what I mean? Context sensitive hub. Yeah. Minimap's a bad element. Uh, I kind of agree with that. Like, you, you tend to stare at maps. You know what I really don't like minimaps on? Shooter games. You don't even, you don't even look at the game. You just look at the map. I need to remember I don't need to press this. Alright, so we're gonna have to go down somewhere. Do I need to go from like underneath the boat? Oh, 
that was a mistake. Oh shit, I think I see it, chat. I think we do have to go from underneath the boat. Wind Temple B2. Um, you got dope shit, by the way, bro. Uh, let's switch to that. Ow, why did I not jump? I need to I need to learn how to game chat. All right, come on. I'm like waiting to jump back. I'm just tanking everything. Unlimited food, tank everything. Yeah, I think I totally agree with that. Whereas I have all the time and patience. That's it, Link. We've unlocked them all. We should be able to open up the hatch in the main room. I love you, Tolan. Do it from there. There we go. Sometimes you just gotta tank your all your enemies' fights. Hor I'm horrible at combat, apparently. It'll get there. Yeah, shooter games I don't like mini maps on just I don't like that you can see like where your opponents are the whole time and I just think you focus on that too much. Am I gonna get a wingsuit at some point? Okay, let's go. Whoa. Fuck yes. He's got a hole in his fucking body now. Why is this so cool? <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> Link, below you. 
Where is he? Thank you. Good call. Good, sh good look out there, Tullin. That was a good call. This is a pretty epic fight. Oh, so you could definitely kill him faster than I was, too. If you get underneath him, you can 100% kill him faster, chat. Tullin's the best wingman? I'm gonna allow that one. That was legit. That was sick. <laughs> yeah, I probably should have been combining my arrows and stuff, but I was having a good time. I don't even, I don't want to, I want to play this game over and over again, but I never want to speed run it because I don't want to like, I don't know, it's so cool. Wish that fight was tougher. I could see people having problems with it. Once I figured out I could go below him, it was on. Ooh, a fucking tear? Nut. No, I don't think I took any damage. Yeah, I don't I I don't think it I took damage when I hit him, which is weird. Heart container. Let's go. Let's go. Tullin. Whose voice is it? It's you. You're the one who's been guiding us? Raru? Wait. Yes. I am your ancestor from a time long ago. I proudly served Hyrule's first king. I was a Rito warrior and a sage with control of the wind. Where you fight, the winds follow. I would expect nothing less from my descendant. 
You make me proud. That monster you defeated, the source of that intense blizzard, it was summoned by the Demon King. The fucking Demon King. He thought he could stop you from obtaining the stone you just found. My secret stone. Demon King? Secret stone? This is a lot to learn all of a sudden. I know. But listen while I tell you what happened in the past. A tale of the imprisoning war. And the mission our people must accomplish. Jeez. Just can't get yeah, catch up, Tolan. Years ago, when the kingdom of Hyrule was still young, a great evil, the Demon King, descended on the land. He sought to wipe out anyone who opposed him. Munraru, the first king of Hyrule, requested my aid, as well as that of five other warriors, to help in the fight. Raru entrusted us oh, there's with Zelda. amazing artifacts, secret stones, objects that amplified our formidable abilities. I've carried one into battle. Yeah, the original champion. It was thrilling to fight alongside my fellow sages. Yet we were sages. still no match for the Demon King's overwhelming power. His magic was staggering, and I was unable to slip past his defenses, no matter how hard I tried. In the end, King Rauru realized that we would not be able to defeat the Demon King. To save our world, King Rauru sacrificed himself and sealed the Demon King away. So that was the Imprisoning War. The Imprisoning War. Okay, but the how did the rest of us survived that climactic battle? And I would soon receive a visitor with a request that would define the future of the Rito. Zelda. It was another of the six sages, the Sage of Time. The Demon King will return. The magic binding him will be undone. When that time comes. A noble swordsman named Link will oppose him. But Link will only succeed with the Rito's help. Summon the winds and support this hero. It was clear what part the Rito would play. It will be an honor to defeat the Demon King. Zelda, because Zelda is back in time. The Demon King returns. The Rito so, Sage of Wind will awaken once more. There, so... And you can count on the full support of the Rito. I'm going to break down the Zelda Breath of the Wild specific timeline right now. A little bit. And now you know about the Imprisoning War and a mission I accepted on our behalf. You've saved Rito Village, but there's more to do. The Demon King will soon recover his full strength. Tulin, my brave fledgling, you must take up my secret stone and honor the Sage of Time's request. Fight the Demon King with the Swordsman Link. Heavy. So it's my mission to fight the Demon King with you? I don't want to fight. Link! This is so, so amazing! I can't believe my ancestor gave me such an important mission. And it involves fighting alongside you to save the world! If we don't do anything, then the world is going to be in big trouble. Big trouble. I can't let that happen. I'll do this. I'll happily take this secret stone. It's like whatever happened, happened. Like, okay, so that's that's what it seems like the 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 way they're doing this time travel. The way I'm gathering it. Kind of like um like Looper or Whoa, how would you just learn that, bro?
That was sick. Link, hold out your hand. Well, you have a giant hand. I guess it's I, Tulin, the Sage of Wind, swear to fight by your side until the end. Take this. It's proof that I'm with you. Wait, is he giving me a power? Did he just give me a power? Did he just give me his wind power? That's how birds have sex, yeah. Oh, ads on the ring, that's hot. That's like, where, where am I getting buttons though for new powers? That ring to call on my power anytime, all right? Okay, let's head back to the village and tell Dad. All right, so Zelda's born. Sometime about 20 years later, the calamity happens. A hundred years later, calamity ends. So many years later, Zelda goes down underneath the castle, open, gets the tier of time, and then teleports back 10,000 years ago where she does all these things that she's already done. All those things happened in history. She was always a part of that forever. Yeah. She was always going to do that. Like that always happened. That never not happened, I guess, if that makes sense. So, like, when she comes back, if she does come back to her time, it's going to be after whatever she did back then. Yeah, like, she's there for a certain amount of time before she comes back. It's like her legend, yeah. Very 13 monkeys, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, yeah. Where's, where's the beast, though? Like, that's all I'm saying. Where's the beast? Isn't snow melting that fast a bad thing? Yeah, that would have created flash floods. Oh. We did do it. <laughs> hmm. It was easy once we started working together. It's like in Lost. They went back in time, but they always went back in time. They were never not going to go back in time. They were always going to go back in time, no matter what. They had to. Hmm. Zelda back in time isn't actually doing anything that changes anything. If that makes sense. Huh. This bow meant so much to you, and now you're giving it to me? Hmm. Could I have your old bow, though, dude? Because I like that old bow. Well, it's true right now. Zelda's not... Like, Zelda can't take any action that actually affects today's world other than action she was already going to take. I'll prove to you that I've become a warrior worthy of carrying it. But that's like a weird way of time travel. Hmm. He linked that women in the visions my ancestor just showed us. Didn't she look just like Princess Zelda to you? Yes! I do. Still a bunch of unanswered questions. Uh -huh. You gonna go look into it personally? Next time you see me, I'll have more information about Princess Zelda. So check in with you sometime. I will. I will. Wow. 